G'day everyone, so in this video we're going to be solving trigonometric equations. So just remember to look out when we can use trig, you need to have a right angle, okay? So you need to have a right angle, if you don't have that then you can't use trig. So just be aware of that before you get started. Then all you really need to remember that you would have learnt before um, is your soccer toa, okay? And breaking down each triangle to work this out. So we'll go through our examples, I like to label um, the sides first relevant to the angle that we're looking at. So I'll go through and do that for these three examples. So just remember the H stands for the hypotenuse. This is opposite our right angle. Okay. Um, o is opposite and that's opposite our angle. And then A is adjacent and that's just next to our angle. Okay. And we'll do that for all the other ones as well. Okay, and now we just need to break down um, which trigonometric equation to use and then solve for our unknown. So we'll go through our first one. So here we've got an angle of 50 degrees and we're given the value of the hypotenuse and we need to work out the adjacent side. So for this we need to use cosine. So we set up our trigonometric equation, the cosine of 50 is equal to, and just remember this is adjacent over hypotenuse, so it will be x over 10. Now because our angle is given in degrees, make sure that your calculator is in degrees setting or else this mightn't work for you and you'll get the wrong answer. So we just need to rearrange our equation, so multiply both sides by 10, so this becomes 10 times cosine 50 is x. and here you should get an answer of 6.42788. So it's always good to check your calculators in the right setting, degree and radian. Make sure you look that up if you don't know how to change it. All right, we'll go through our second one here, E. We're trying to find an angle. So we set up our trigonometric equation. We're working with adjacent and opposite here. So this is going to be our tan to the TOA, so our tan of theta is equal to opposite over adjacent, 6 over 5. So to do this we need to do the inverse tan to find theta in your calculator of 6 over 5. Okay, so this there should now give you an answer of your calculators in degrees of 50.12 degrees, okay? Now finally, we have this one. We've got an angle and we need to work out our opposite from our hypotenuse. So, guessed it, hopefully, we'll be using sine for this one. So our sine of 20 is equal to x over 10. So x is going to equal to 10 times sine 20. Make sure your calculator is in degrees because we're working with a degree, not a radian here. So here, this should give you an answer of 3.4202. Okay, there's no units there, so we don't need to put units. All right, so hopefully this gives you an understanding of how to work out our trigonometric equations and good luck.